A driver who fled Minneapolis police will be charged for causing a violent car crash on University Avenue today. The three vehicle collision happened just after noon at the intersection of University and 17th Avenue Northeast. Police called off the pursuit for safety reasons. Bill Hudson explains why the driver may have feared being stopped. Outside Holy Cross Catholic Church, a quiet holiday ends in a violent thud. A noontime collision sent debris flying and six people to the hospital. Ken Harrington was nearby and saw paramedics treating the injured. They took at least 15 to 20 minutes when I was here to put the neck brace on them and um, get them into the ambulances. Two men in this green Honda were the most seriously hurt, broadsided by a maroon Crown Victoria. Only minutes earlier, that vehicle's driver sped away from officers attempting a traffic stop. Officers observed the vehicle being driven erratically and carelessly, actually recklessly. So they attempted a traffic stop and the driver chose to not yield but flee. Police called off their pursuit after one minute, but that didn't end the driver's high-speed flight. Speeds were approximately 50 miles an hour. A pickup truck was also struck. After crashing into both vehicles, the suspect still tried to get away. The person in the red or maroon car actually got out and started running away. And then the police were here fast enough and was able to get them. Methamphetamines were later found in the suspect's vehicle, which may explain the driver's flight, though not the disregard for the safety of others. Bill Hudson, WCCO, 4 News. And all six people, including the suspect driver, were transported to the hospital. All are being treated for non-life-threatening injuries.